right, here's the bottom of the MacArthur Bridge where it floods. We're an hour past high tide. It's still pretty bad, and these cars are driving through the salt water. It's also on that exit ramp there. It's in the under exit ramp off there, and it's by the Arch Center building. Oh, and it's way over here, too. It's actually just as bad over here as anywhere. There's a really good photo of a, of a, of a tide worse than this one uh, of a car passing through there under the Metro Mover. It's, it's actually a Creative Commons photo, but it's, it's got the one non commercial restriction, so it's a little bit harder to find. It's not everywhere. But, uh,. But yeah, that's 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 bad enough. I mean, it's not deep enough to flood a car out. But then again, this is an hour past high tide, and this is not the worst tide. I left the beach because this this is where things get stupid on the beach. Between the fact that you have you know a temporary pump set up, you know this noise pollution. It's it's uh it's it's it's, it's wrong in principle. This you know this polluting diesel generators. You know, for that to be the temporary solution. Um, the way the pipe that were coming out of the water like that, that's dangerous. So, you know, it was hard to get them, them back in. I can see where that, that could be dangerous. They're splashing all over. They could, they could at least hit, you know, a property or a vehicle. And then somebody else, you know, an idiot like me who tries to throw them back in or is just around them gets hit by one. You know, it's just, it's just, it's, that's why Band-Aids doesn't matter if it was free. It doesn't matter if those pumps were given to them. You know, it, it wouldn't matter. That's not really, one real pump there would, would take care of that whole area there. And then the seawall has to be fixed. It's a different issue. But like that, that that's just an that's just an example of, of stupid to cover stupid, you know, as a band aid to something that was a mistake. You know, it's it's uh, it's 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 not worth it at all. You know, you just see that this is pretty bad here. I, I actually kind of want to check out Brickle in here more. Miami Beach, you know, it's kind of all or nothing there now. If the pumps work, they work. If and if, and if it gets past the one seawall, then it'll be a catastrophic flood. So it'll go from what it is now, which is not much because of the two pumps. You know, that garage was the whole story yesterday, really. And then it'll, it'll go from that to, uh, it'll go from zero to 100 if, if that topples. But this, this is pretty cool. This is the actually, this is actual Miami here. You know, this is like one of the only times someone says Miami and they actually mean actual Miami. That's why I call it actual Miami. They're usually talking about the somewhere in the county or the beach. Even, even, even in Fort Lauderdale, people call it Miami. So this is, this is actual Miami being affected here a little bit.